I never charge a fee. We're entering a great time for investing in New York City real estate. Some facts about the New York City real estate market that I share with my clients. I'm Daniel J. Bollinger, licensed real estate salesperson. I focus mostly on residential sales and rentals. I'm a new development expert and luxury specialist for my tenor as the real estate editor for New York Lifestyles magazine. And I've lived in the city for over 20 years, so I know it very well. I left the magazine to focus on real estate because I see one of the best buyers market in real estate in years. I successfully called the top of the market in 2017 in my notes from DB article. And with the current state of the financial markets, global politics, there's a great window of opportunity present to buyers in the market right now. The financial markets are now entering correction territory, which is a leading indicator for the real estate market. Combine that with the oversupply of new developments on the market, the end of the busy fall buying season, which has been a little flat, and we're entering a great time for investing in New York City real estate. Some facts about the New York City real estate market that I share with my clients is that the New York City real estate market, from an investment perspective, is a great store of value. It's a great hedge against inflation. In a softening market, the New York City market doesn't fall as much as other markets. It's one of the first cities to bounce back. It bounces back stronger and higher than most other cities. New York City is one of the safest cities to invest in. On a broader scale, we've had a 37-year bull market in this country. The bull and bear markets tend to last about 35 years or so. So we seem to be on a cusp of a reversal to a bear market. If we do enter a bear market, wealth usually transfers from paper assets like stocks and bonds to physical assets like real estate.